Ngayong araw sa PTV Sports Chat, dumalaw ang CEO, President at Founder ng UGB MMA Corporation na si Fernand Monsayak. Kahit retirado na si Papa Goat, patuloy na ginagampanan ni Monsayak ang mga pwede niyang gawin sa mundo ng mixed martial arts dito sa Pilipinas. Panoorin po natin ito. Welcome to another episode of PTV Sports Chat. For today, we have Ferdinand Bunsayak, also known as Papa Goat, the MMA promoter and president of Underground Battle. Bro, umusta and finally, nagkita na tayo dito. Yeah, mabuti naman, mabuti naman, bro. Thanks for having me over here. Uh, finally, just like you said, uh, and very timely yung, yung ano natin yan, the interview. Yeah, I'm sure marami ka pag-usapan kasi I understand you have an upcoming event. Oh yeah, yeah, we do, we do. But yeah. before that, Musta ka na? Yun <laughs> muna. Uh, ito mabuti. Uh, always busy. Like always naman, which is always good. Kasi mabuti yung meron tayong ginagawa palagi. Pwede, hindi mo pwedeng nakatunga nga lang tayo. Ano. So, yeah, it's, it's always a good thing. Stay busy. Yeah, so ito yun. But one thing um, I'm, ano, I look up to when you hold these events is grassroots. Yes. Kumbaga, there are a lot of uh, new faces, yes. but they have talent. Of course. So, how's that been going along for you? Oh, it's been going great, bro. I mean, after 10 years, we're almost uh, 10 years old now, uh, towards the end of this month. Mm -hmm. And uh, a lot has changed already. And the good thing is, uh, despite uh, all the challenges and the toxicity and negativity, I mean, we're still here, we're still afloat, we're still alive. So, thank God for, for all of that. And thank you guys for, for uh, of course, Dial. Uh, you've been giving us the opportunity ever since we met uh, last year. Uh, I mean, you never fail to send people over a team to cover our events, and we're very, very grateful for that. Yeah, and so, there are some events I'm, I'm, I, I wish I was there. I'm not going to mention why, but you already know that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, from these grassroots, these uh, fighters who have shown potential, has there been any one of them na talagang umangat? Oh yeah, um, there there are uh, there are a lot actually over the past ten years now, and one who's really hot right now in one championship is uh, Jeremy the Jaguar Miado. He, yeah, he came from uh, grassroots and uh, he came from Lions Den MMA in Bicol, and his master was uh, shout out nga pala kay Master Dante Madrideo. That's where he came from, and then he got turned over to me, and uh, in three months' time, uh, sent him over to one, and now he's creating a lot of waves and hopefully he gets his opportunity to go up against Jared Brooks for the uh, strawweight title, the belt itself. Wow. Yeah, so, yeah. Okay, you said the Jaguar na nga si Jeremy Mia. Yes. So, no. Do you see any, uh, what do you call this, uh, fighters who may follow his footsteps? Oh, of course, there are always fighters who will be ready to follow, you know, the footsteps. Because they, they have seen everything that's, uh, that's transpired yeah. and the evolution basically and then everything else in the, uh, in the event, in the promotion, things are getting better. I mean, we're getting more sponsors, people are getting to know us, uh, all the kind of work that we've been doing. So it's, it's really, really good. Yeah, it, it's only going to get better. That's all I have to say. So moving on, uh, you'll, you'll be having more events. I'm sure, aside from this upcoming event, you'll have more events up ahead. Yeah, there will be, for sure, oh, for sure. Okay, before we go to that, let me ask you about this upcoming event. You're, you have an upcoming event. Yes, we do. Uh, it's, it's, I just want to invite everyone. Uh, this is going to happen on April 29th. This is going to be our 10th anniversary event and also our 92nd fight event for, uh, for 10 years. It's going, it's going down at the uh, Moranto Sports Complex, mm -hmm. and I would like everyone to, uh, I would like to invite everyone to come out and check us out. Because it's not just going to be uh, MMA fights, mm -hmm. not just combat sports, but this time we're also going to have uh, sports cars on display. Cool. We're going to have a motor show. There will be cosplayers. Yeah, so it's something pretty big. Yeah, our cool. biggest so far. Yeah, that's what we're we're always aiming for. We're always trying to aim for, you know, bigger than the last. Okay. Yeah. Is this a one-day event? Or? Yeah, it's only going to be a one-day event. Uh, we also have uh, six Koreans flying, uh, yeah, flying from uh, Busan and Seoul. And uh, five of them are males, one female. And of course, Korea versus Pinas. That's what's going to happen. And then there will also be four championship belts on the line. Ooh. Yes. So it's going to be pretty, pretty exciting. Uh, showcasing our local talents, of course. Uh, some of them are already uh, veterans in the field and it's about time that they get this kind of break that they, they really deserve. 
Okay, before we end the uh, bridge, I want to uh, give you the floor. You want to make shout outs or greet oh, yeah, anybody? Yeah, of course. And, uh, and oh, I you have a list, huh? I, have, I have to come up. I have to <laughs> open up my list because I don't want to miss anybody out there. Right, I'm pretty ahead. sure there are going to be more that are going to be left out, but for the most part, I just want to do a shout out. Okay, first of all, uh, shout out sa Aguila, sa mga Aguila, actually, of uh, the city of Santa Rosa, uh, Matikas Eagles Club. Uh, shout out to Kuya Gov, Richard Portugal. Yes, and kay Ate Sheng, uh, ang mabuting may bahay ni, ni Kuya Gold. And then to all the Eagles out there, thank you. Uh, thank you for your support. Uh, bili pa po kayo ng tickets. We still have a lot. Yeah, uh, siyempre Amoranto, that's pretty yeah, big. Really so, big. yeah, just keep buying the tickets, guys. Um, and of course, shout out to all the U.S. Navy Chiefs out there. Yeah, maraming salamat for believing and supporting and everything else. Yeah, shout out kay Yuyu de Guzman of uh, the... Uh, United Car Club of the Philippines. He is going to be there. His group will be supporting us. Hazel Ileto naman din for the Moto Show. Uh, that's Boss B Productions. Uh, shout out to uh, Brian Izaguirre, Javi, my matchmaker, Team Underdogs, Team Bruiser's Gym, Team Psychopath, Team UGB, of course, and to my uh, ever faithful and right hand, uh, Perla May Tagakay, of course. Was always there by my side, never left for the past five years. Siya lang ang nakatagal, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> and shout out to Mark Alan Munsai, who's been helping us right now to, to do all the preps for uh, Quezon City and Amoranto. Kat Yamson, shout out Salvaje Eyes for the sponsorship. My brother and my good friend Khalid Montalban. Crew Brian Barameda, Master Doming, and a whole lot more. I know I don't really have all the time, but thank you so much, guys, for all the support. Wala ang UGB dito. Hindi naka survive ng 10 past 10 years kung wala kayo without the love, support, and everything else. So, thank you so much. And thank you, Brother Brian, for always being there. You know, whenever I need exposure, whenever I need uh, the news coverage, you're always there. So, thank you so much. Hey, Bill, of course, Bill Velasco, Sir Jerry uh, King Rodriguez for introducing me to you guys, and hey, JJ Magirang. And like I said, everybody else, I can keep going, on, going for hours here, but yeah, I won't be able to get everybody's things. But thank you so much. Can you yeah. love, bro? Oh, yeah, yeah, I am very loved. Like when this thing happened, mm -hmm. this accident, yeah. oh my God, I could not believe it. It's almost like 900, you know, reactions and like, you know, it's like a lot of people. Like, wow, yeah, I was really, I was really touched. I was really moved. Yes. All right. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay, thank you everybody, and we hope you enjoyed our time with Papa Goat, um, Freddy Munsaya. Please catch us on our next episode.